Hello guys, in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how you can make this motion graphic cartoon eye by using PowerPoint. So without wasting your time, let's start creating. Here you can see that I have already taken a blank slide. So first go to design, click on format background and from here I'm just changing the background color. Now close it, go to home and from here pick oval shape. Then holding Ctrl Shift, drag it over here. Now go to Format, click on Shape Fill and change the color. Again go to Shape Outline, make no outline. Then press Ctrl D to duplicate and change this color to white. Now just bring it to here and decrease its size from the bottom. Now select these two shapes and holding Ctrl Shift, drag it to right and it will be duplicated. Now press Ctrl G to group them together, holding Ctrl Shift, resize it and rotate like this way. Then what you need to do, you need to select this square circle and change its color and do the same for this ash circle. After changing the color, just bring it to here and select this ash circle, press Ctrl D to duplicate, change its color from shape fill Holding Ctrl Shift, make it a smaller one, place it over here. Holding Ctrl Shift, I'm just resizing it a bit more. Then press Ctrl D to duplicate, change this color to white. Now click on the small icon and increase the transparency to 25%. Holding Ctrl Shift, make it a smaller one and place it over here. Then we just need to select only these circles and press Ctrl Z to group them together. Now select all of these, holding Ctrl Shift, drag it to here and it will be duplicated. Then I'm just placing all of these in the exact middle of our slide. Now we need to add the animation. So first select this group of shapes, go to animation, click on add animation and from motion paths, select these arcs. After doing that, we need to drag this red arrow and place it over here. Then resize it like this way from the bottom. If you start the slideshow, you can see that our animation is working. Now I need to set start after previous and the duration 1.75 seconds. Again select this shape, click on animation painter and paste the animation on this group of shapes. And then set start with previous. Now again select this ash circle, press Ctrl D to duplicate. Now place it in the exact middle to cover this up, resize it a bit. And go to home, pick a rectangle shape and drag it over this circle. Now I need to select these two shapes. Go to format, click on merge shape and select fragment. Then from here, we just need to delete this extra portion. Here you can see now we have two half circles. So holding the control button select this two and change its color so that it matches with the background. Now select this one, go to animation, click on add animation and from motion pass select this line animation. Now from effect option select up. Then holding the shift key, drag this red arrow to the top. From here, keep it on click and the duration 1 second. Now click on animation pane to look over our animation. Now select this one again. Click on animation painter to copy our animation and paste it on it. Now from effect option, select down. And from here, change it to with previous and duration 1 seconds. Now select this two and holding the control shift drag it over here to cover this one also. You can see that our animations has also been copied. So I'm just selecting this one and changing it to with previous. Now holding the control button select this four animation and drag them to the top. Now if you start the slideshow you can see that our animations are working perfectly. Here we need to do one more thing, so select this animation, click on this drop down arrow and go to effect option. Now from here, just select this auto reverse and press ok. Now do the same for this one also, 
click on this drop down arrow go to effect option and select this auto reverse and press ok and we are done with our animation you can download this template for free i have given the download link in the video description if you have enjoyed this tutorial make sure like and subscribe this channel and don't forget to share with your friends hope to see you in the next tutorial and thanks for watching